Hi guys, so today I'm going to be filming a products I've used up video. Oh my god, I totally screwed that up. Um, I'm really digging my makeup right now, so take a moment to appreciate it. Yeah, I don't usually go this intense, but I am really into it, so I might start. But I need a foundation that actually matches my skin, because like honestly, this one doesn't match my skin whatsoever but I'm just rolling with it. But anyways, I have a bunch of products in this box and um, also a couple of food items because um, why not? Your girl looks loves some food, so <laughs> yeah. Anyway, oh also, burgundy like wineish colored shirt. Isn't that totally fall? I'm so ready for fall. <sighs> yeah. Anyways, so let's just hop into it. Ew, I hate myself too. First thing I have here is some Wild Roots Real Food for Real People Premium Premium Trail Mix. This is delicious, honestly. I got this at Costco, and I wanted to put this in here just because I think it's that good. I finished this in like two days, and yeah, it's a large bag. It's just so good. Then I have another item that is freaking delicious. And um, that's the reason I put it in here. The Brookside Cr Crunchy Clusters. These are awesome. Okay. If you've ever tried Brookside, like the little, I don't know, they have, they have like the as acai ones. And um, some blueberry, like, I don't know. It's like blueberry, chocolate covered blueberry type things. I don't know. Anyways. So. If you've ever tried those and you love them, try these. These are like 10 times better. <sighs> I love them. Okay, people, you can stop doing construction now. <gasps> Anyways, so it's like when you bite into it, oh, it feels so good. You know, gets me going. Anyway, then I have a Batiste dry shampoo in coconut, a coconut and exotic tropical. I don't know. Um, this wasn't that great. Honestly, I don't get the whole Batiste dry shampoo, like, thing. Like, how everybody's so obsessed with it. Like, I don't understand it. It's not that good. It doesn't, like, I find that my hair should feel, like, I don't know, a different way. <laughs> it just, it's just not that good. It smells good. So I put this in my hair so it smells good. And I bought another one, like the dark haired one. Um, so I'm trying that out. I still don't think it's that good. I just think it smells good, honestly. Then I have, look, I, um, I have the I Love Juicy Lush Shampoo. This was amazing. I freaking, okay, I was so mad. I went to Florida and I had like this much left, okay? I came back and I had nothing left in it and I was like, excuse you, my sister used it all, what the heck? I just love it so much though, it smells so good. And like, you can see there's kind of stuff in there but I couldn't get it out when I was trying to use it and like, it was like this in my shower and everything, and it just wasn't coming out. <sighs> but it smells good, and it works so well. I love it. I'm definitely repurchasing this. I'm going to buy it in the bigger size because, you know what? Your girl loves it. Oh, why do I keep saying your girl? Like, I don't know. Then I have the Lush Happy Hippie Shower Gel, and I'm pretty sure I love this as well. I used this up a while ago. Oh, it smells so good. Like, honestly, if it smells good, I love it, you know? This is really good. Like, I love all Lush, like, shampoos and, like, um, body wash type things. So, this is good. Um, then I have two of the big um, shampoos. Okay, there's one that I finished up a really long time ago, and then I finished this one up, and then I had another one, because <laughs> I love, this is my all-time favorite Lush shampoo. It's amazing. It smells, like, good, and, like, the other day, my friend was like, oh my god, your hair smells so good, and I was like, oh my god, it's big, and then she was like, I know. That was a horrible story, but, you know, it smells good, like, I mean, it's just, it smells like 
sea salt, but like it smells so good, like refreshing and like it feels good in your hair. <laughs> it feels good when it's like just in your hair and like I don't know, it's just awesome. However, I must say, you gotta like the first time I used it, I was like, oh, what the hell is happening here? And then I kind of figured out how to use it, and yeah. Anyways, then another product I used up, obviously, is the Macadamia Natural Oil Deep Repair Mask. And this is another thing. I was really mad. I got back from Florida, and, um, well, it had, like, maybe three uses in it. But, oh, God. That smells really perfumey. Oh, my gosh. It doesn't smell that perfumey when you put it in your hair, but, like, it... But this is amazing. It makes your hair so soft. And, yeah. I am gonna buy another one. But I think I kind of want to take a break because I've been using this for, like, two years. And this tub lasts so long. I mean, it's $30, but... It lasts me like from last December to now and like my sister uses it sometimes and pisses me off but um yeah this is amazing I love it then okay this has been making this box smell so good it's the Bath and Body Works Cinnamon Caramel Swirl Candle. I don't know, well, I'm guessing this is Christmas um, edition, but I know we got it, like, not at Christmas time. It was, like, after when everything's on sale, you know? But this... <laughs> Having the burnt wicks in there, like, kind of makes it smell funky, but it smells so good, and, like, it made the box smell good. I'm, I swear. This is, like... I just remember this, like, being on in the house, or, like, being lit up in the house, and then, like, my brother came in the house once, and he was like, oh my god, are you making cookies? And I was like, no. Candle! And then everyone was depressed because there was no cookies. Yeah. Anyways, then I have a sample of the Dr. Dennis Gross, um, Alpha Beta P- Alpha Beta Peel? thing um okay like I saw in a video that like someone used this to like like before putting on their foundation and stuff like to smooth it, their skin out I was like oh okay like and I had gotten samples of this I think it was free sample no I had bought I had bought like a box that was like skincare sample type things from Sephora and anyways, so this was in there, and like the first time I tried it, it like really burned my skin, kind of. Like, I don't know, it didn't really burn it, but like when I was applying it, it was stinging kind of thing. So I was like, okay, no, not using that. And then I saw that video, and I was like, oh, people are using that like before putting on a foundation. Hmm. So then I used it again, and like it still like kind of stung, but then it stopped stinging after like... A minute and then you apply the the second thing and it still stung and then stops stinging after like a minute and I was like okay must be all right and then my skin felt like so soft so yeah I might buy the actual things I don't know I don't know how expensive they are so if they're really expensive uh-uh but um yeah then I have last thing actually is the first aid beauty pure skin face cleanser with fab antioxidants oh shoot i should also have a glam glow um like i'll put a picture like the face wash in there because i used that up but you know what it's because like the the pump broke so i had to like take it all out of there and then I threw out the whole container but that thing is amazing it replaced this I used to be obsessed with this and then I tried out the glam glow one and honestly I swear by the, the glam glow one this one is good and like it didn't irritate my skin or anything but the glam glow one is like I love it okay what am I doing honestly I'm being so weird 
<laughs> I'm hungry. Okay, bye. <laughs> I'm sorry. Okay, follow me on Instagram, Twitter, VSCO. I love you. See you in my next video. Bye.